Well, good morning, everybody. Welcome to uh, another, uh, what is this, a Labor Day edition of uh, Network Admin Life. Grace and peace to you from our Lord Jesus Christ and all the saints here in California. Um, I'm going to try to talk loud. I, do you have any suggestions for a good uh, mic that will work with an Android phone? I'd appreciate it. Otherwise, i got to yell. So I'm just going to give you guys a data center update. We've, uh, we've done a little more work. We've uh, added a little more equipment. Uh, actually, I don't know. I might have talked about this equipment before. I can't remember. Uh, we've, we've added some cabling. And we've moved things around in the rack a little bit. We, uh, we keep deciding re and re-deciding where things should go. So, And that's fine. You know, the boss has got to be happy. Um, so today what I was going to talk a little bit about is because we moved things around, we had to take cables out, we had to completely uh, de-rack all of these switches here, pull them out, move them around, put them back in. And that, so we had to take all the cables off to do that. And uh, so what I was going to talk about is labeling your cables. Um, I chose, I have a labeler where you can uh, pretty much print out the label and then wrap it around a cable. Well, I also use those on fiber cables, too. Here, let me find a good example of one here. It's not completely upside down. Um, so all my fibers, are actually every cable in the data center that's going to be in the core, we're going to label. And uh, this, the, uh, the standard I use is on the top line, I put the switch in the port that it's plugging into. And on the bottom line, I put in the switch in the port it's coming from. So every cable I could take off and put it right back where it was, because I know where it comes from, where it goes to. So uh, and it, it works on round cables too. So even these these cables here that are that are round, we've still got the uh, the labels on them right there. Tell us where it goes from, where it goes to, other end, where it goes from, where it goes to. So um, all these fibers we added yesterday, we have not labeled those. This is going to be one of our redundant runs out to the closet. Uh, so for each closet we have in the hospital, we're going to have one multi-link trunk coming to this set of switches here, right here, and then another set, another multi-link trunk going down to the basement to an identical set of switches. And then these two switches, the two switches, the identical switches down in the basement, that's the core of our fabric. It's basically a virtual core. Um, so yeah, we'll basically have what we see here. This is duplicated here, and this is duplicated down in the basement. So we're just looking for as much redundancy as we can get. Um, one of the nice things that's going to be about that is I can update the firmware on this switch, reboot it, and it won't take the network down. I can update the firmware on this switch, reboot it, and it won't take the network down. So uh, that's that's going to be kind of nice. Um, so yeah, uh, all we're waiting for to really get this going is for our vendors to come back in and help us with some of the uh, port configs on this, this switch here. Um, we'll bring in a second internet circuit from Comcast. It's going to go right up there. And uh, yeah, that's basically it. Things are coming along pretty nicely. Uh, like I said yesterday, with just a little bit of a cleanup in here. Not a whole lot of progress forward, but uh, we're expecting to move along here uh, pretty quick. We've got a, a switch here that we've added. It's a um, test closet, basically. And uh, myself and my boss are, are both on this switch. And everything's been working really good. So, uh, yeah, that's about it. So, I hope uh, hope you're liking the content we provide. I'll, I'll be uh, providing more updates on this as we go along, and uh, looking forward to it. So, if you like what you watch, uh, like what you saw, click the subscribe button, uh, click the notification bell if so inclined, and. Uh, Everybody, just thanks for joining. I really appreciate all the comments. Um, I really appreciate hearing that uh, if, if you're inspired that there's another 
Christian, godly, well, I don't know how godly I am. I try. Um, thank God Jesus' blood covers us all. Um, at least those of us who claim him. Um, but but I'm glad that, the, the, you know, it, it inspires you to know there's other Christian guys out here in the, in the field. And we are. We are out here. We're just hard to find. So anyway, thanks for watching. We'll catch you later. God bless.